Jazzy, my Jazzy. Hey, hey. Simle. Is it Chimle? Hey, hey, is it Chimle? Guys, greeting everyone out there that come across this video for the very first time. You are welcome to this girl's page, this girl's channel, anything you want to call it, you are welcome. So, guys, let's go straight to the point. It's just in time. After this thing, we are watching. So, there is one just one time. So, in case, these women I want to talk about, you, please, women. In case you know your husband like going to one particular joint or one particular bar, you know how your husband like going there. If it is man that owns the place or if it is woman that owns the place, don't go and quarrel the woman or don't go and quarrel the man. Or. The thing you need to do is, yes, I'm telling you, the thing you need to do is to walk up to the woman and tell the woman, please, I want to see you. Or if it's a guy that owns the bar, guy or I want to see you, polite manner, good manner. And Ella lied to him that you know that your husband like coming here to drink. So he does not give you money. When he drinks finish, he used to come and beat you. That's how you tell him. You whine it and tell him. Then the guy will not see it as her. You say, sir, look me as your sister. If I'm your sister that your uh, somebody gets married and the person like drinking and come and be beating me up, will you like it? That my husband, anytime he comes to your bar, you come and beat me. I didn't say you should drive him more. But at least if he's taking five bottles, please reduce this to three or four bottles. The person will understand. But you some women will go there and go and shout. Go and be shouting for the wom woman that owns the bar or the man that owns the bar. Okay, you're the one giving my uh, her husband drink. I will arrest you. You're the one doing this. You're the one hey, hey. They'll be talking anyhow. Before you know, now, if, if it is a man that owns the bar, he will just go and look for one pin or pin or one babe and go and give to your husband. Before you know, your husband will not come to the house again. You like, you like, don't learn something from this thing I'm telling you. It's a story. That that one woman used to go to one uh, woman's uh, joints and be shouting. That time my mom too used to sell drink. Since my mom does not have strength now, as a age woman now, old woman, we no get time to one thing, one take young bobo. She will come and talk and talk and talk. One other lady now say, if it is she, let her come and try it. She now went to the woman's shop and start quarreling the woman. Say, is you that is always giving my husband drink? I will deal with you. I will do like the woman that say, hey, I've been hearing it. You've been saying it. You've been doing it to other people. And you've been doing, you've did it to Angel's mother. And because she did not answer, you mean I'm a young girl. If you try it with me, I will deal with you. The uh, lady now went and this woman this woman that's okay you will not see your husband again that's how this lady took the husband from that woman that was making mouth always shouting coming to my mom's shop to shout that my mom should not be selling her husband drink like that my mom, that, my mom that used to advise him as in talk to him advise him talk to him the woman that took the lady's husband from her my mother and I say, Sam, in life it's no good when you know you have husband. You know your husband likes this particular thing and he has always been going to that place. He likes it. No matter how you tell him, he will not go. He will not stop. He will not stop. Someone just call me. He will not stop. Then why wasting your time, killing yourself, complaining? That's how the woman took the her husband from her. The husband, till today. They are still staying together. Now that other woman that was shouting and bragging and talking and talking, her husband has left her. And this man is still staying with this other woman. So if it is even man that owns the shop, that your husband likes going to that place, use the good manner and go and talk to the man. No, I'm telling you this expo, this thing that happened. Go and talk to the man and beg him that, sir, please, I better take me as your sister. If I'm your sister, that a man will go out and drink and come. Start beating me. Will you like it? Talk to him very well. Because if you do not talk to the man very well, that's how the man will go and look for Pino Pino. Small and kege. And give to your husband. For you know, your husband will not come out. So he will not be giving you money the way he used to give you money. So please, be wise. Don't be doing gra gra. In case your husband likes one particular place, those go politely go and talk to the person, whine the person, tell the person things that will make the person hurt to feel as if if she is the one or she is the one. How will she feel? Then they will free your husband. They will be the one calling your husband. Beg, mo kuya something. They make mass for you. You and they beat your wife. Mo kuya something. You and they give your wife money. They start abusing him. The least they start abusing him. That's how your husband gradually will stop going to that place or you stop drinking. But if you say you want to use gag and be doing, they will take him from you. The man will give your husband pino pino. If it is girl that owns the bar, she will start cutting your husband's eye and at least she just put interest and say, what is this woman always coming to complain about this her husband? Okay, let me test it. So guys bye i'll see you guys on my next video so that i can watch
I just let me come and tell you in case you always like you want to go and fight people because your husband is always going to that shop. Be careful, be wise. And me, I've wise. So since that thing happened, I've wise. Can I see you guys on my next video? Bye for now.